We made it to the crib, y'all. I'm about to turn on that Lakers game. Y'all know the vibes. I mean, turn on that motherfucking Lakers game. I was listening to Dupac. You feel me? Just came back going shopping and everything, too. To your boy birthday. I mean, throw down in the comments for me. Happy birthday to your boy. You know what I'm saying? Because it's my birthday, if y'all watching. My birthday probably been passed, but my birthday on December 10th, so. Throw down in the comments. Happy birthday to your boy, man. I'm over here grinding and grooving for y'all. So y'all already know the vibes. You know what I'm saying? My Christmas spirit. Uh, y'all feel me? All right, y'all. Uh, we went food shopping. About to take all the recycling and stuff out now. I know the vibes and take the trash. I know the vibes. With that Mustang key up there, Mercury. And the mines, is it? Yeah, I'm saying my Dodge in the shop right now. Look at my dog. Look, well, she's going for the bowl too, babe. Look, she's in a bowl doing. Look. Hey, we got you a separator bowl. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> Big head. <laughs> yeah, she was separated bowl. All the stuff situated, y'all. Um, yes, yeah, I'll probably hit y'all tomorrow. See y'all tomorrow. Yeah, I'm seeing. My little baby. Yeah. <laughs> my baby girl y'all i'm having a girl if y'all didn't know now y'all know you feel me guys tell y'all y'all know y'all my family shout out to my pops gave me a card and everything for my birthday love you dad feel me it's a nice card bro my dad's the coolest dad you feel me get some light for y'all I see that. I see my grandma over here. I gotta dust my drawer, my dresser, but you feel me? So I do my pops, man. My dad, my mom's, me, baseball, my family. You know the important things to me. <laughs> and my grandma, for sure, for sure. She loved Tupac. And my grandma, my aunt Sue, Mika, my dad right there. And my grandma right here. This is one of her photos that she liked. And she always kept in her house and when I was watching her till she passed away and stuff. So I had to take this with me and then her glasses and stuff. And my girl got me that chain. So yeah, you know what I mean? Little scat pack him. <laughs> and my dad right here too as a kid. So yeah, y'all know the vibes. My dad when he was in jail with my mom and me. So yeah, me, my graduation picture and stuff like that. But yeah, man. So I like to bring y'all along and stuff. Here got my baby girl. If y'all didn't know now, now you do. Walk to the fam. My baby girl, y'all. <laughs> Look at the face right there. You feel me? Face. Got a couple be uh, better ones too. Uh, yeah. Just want y'all to tag along the journey, you know me. I mean. Oh yeah, I went to uh, Primark and stuff, got my stuff. I bought my uh, daughter's, her, uh, I bought daughter her first outfit ever. So I'm gonna show y'all and I'm gonna get my girl's kind of, you know, reaction to it. Cause she didn't know I bought it. But yeah, turn, I'm a father now, y'all. Y'all yeah, know, it's sentimental, you know what I mean? It makes me get emotional. My dog over here ran out. Good boy. Boom. Yeah, Boom. Oh, it's stuff in here. But I got you. <laughs> Look at I got our baby. Oh, baby. They come with the bottom half, too. Oh, my God. Oh, Cute, right? All right, I'm gonna get back to y'all a little bit. My girl halfway naked, so <laughs> can't be putting that on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? The link in the bio, my OnlyFans. It's like, no, I'm bullshit. 
I ain't got one of those. I ain't one. I'm watching Brian and them. He's snapping right now. 6252. Oh, oh, yeah. Moo loves Yoda, yo. This is a blanket? I think it's a regular. Okay, a me. hoodie throw. I think it's her toy. Oh, yeah, I had to cut back the camera on. Lakers up 13 right now, but y'all know I had to show y'all this. Ooh! Throw it on. I throw some pictures up there. This is crazy, dog. Well, yeah, I had to grab that. My team is the Boston Celtics, but I'm a LeBron fan, and you know what I mean. So I'm not gonna say fan. I'm gonna say supporter, cause Mr. Organic say fan. That's for fake ass niggas, and I ain't a fake ass nigga. So I'm definitely a supporter of LeBron. I'm not a hater. I fuck with LeBron. Whatever he do, um, whatever he got going on is definitely. Uh, unique to see and it's like, you know, it's one of a kind bro. He broke all the uh, uh, all-time scoring points and it's just like crazy to see all that stuff. So That's tough, bro. His family and everything. That's like amazing to see all that stuff, man. Other than that, man. Yeah, I, I, I really support and I rock with Brown, bro. Well, I'm gonna catch y'all, man. See y'all tomorrow. See y'all tomorrow. The next day. What's up, y'all? It's the next day. I'm on my way to go get my hair cut again. So, you know, my birthday this weekend. Sunday, y'all hear clunky Becky all the time, but don't worry, we're gonna get that that shit fixed, and then we're gonna, you mean, you mean, you mean, you mean, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I'm on my way down the way, go get my shit chopped and screwed, and I'm in this heat, feel lovely, lovely, lovely. But yeah, man, I'm gonna catch y'all when I get out the barber, man. I showed y'all the stuff that I bought a little bit, that Lakers hoodie. Oh, I love it. That shit's fire. I bought me like a Snoop Dogg uh, doggy supply jacket. That shit was tough. I had to grab that John. It's a reversible John too. So yeah. And I'm in uh I'm in 4 4K 60 frames. So I changed it instead of 30. So let me know how y'all like that one. Let me see how that rock. But uh yeah, it's getting it's cold out this John. Probably end up doing the OU change and everything in this video. If I don't, then I'll make a separate video. But uh most likely, I'm going to try to do it in one video, one take, so that way, I mean, I can change it to the extra vlog on the next one, on another vlog, so, got to stay tuned, man, my barber opened up at 10, I'm on my way down there now, so we in crunch time, I mean, I don't live too far from my barber, so, but with his shop at, I mean, I live at least 35, 40 minutes away, depending on how traffic is, but, uh, yeah, I'm going to catch y'all. All right, y'all, y'all see I got out the barber. You know what I'm saying? Just came from the barber shop. You see me, fresh out of my barber mill once again, always. Going to my barber since I was like, maybe 12, 13, 14. Yeah, I'm 27 now. About to be 27 Sunday, so you know the vibes, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I just picked up the other Dodge key that my cousin had for the started when it was at her house. And I got the other key too. So we're gonna drop that off at the uh, collision caliber. They need the key, so if they total it out or whatever they're gonna do if they fix it so they're gonna have to probably pre -pro uh, reprogram or either program the new ecu to these keys or either get make new keys so we're gonna see what's up so we're gonna drop that off too as well i'm about to slide to my cousin's house my other cousin's house and uh yeah got a lot of cousins <laughs> no but uh i'm about to slide to my cousin's house so she said she need help with her jeep so then her bumper is a little off so we're gonna probably end up you know zip tying it I'm in the trusty Steve Mazda, as y'all see all the time. You know what I'm saying? People want me, people don't want me to get rid of it, but you know, everybody be like, yeah, man, your car, you still got that car? I'm like, yeah, man, you know how to, you know, fix your cars and take care of them, they take care of you. You feel me? If you don't, then they gonna leave you on the side of the road, feel me? Like this motherfucker right here, you might be like, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't even see your little short ass. But you yeah, you put your own work in like my man right here. But if you don't, Feel me? You gonna get left on the side of the road. That's some my shit got stolen there, right here. Right here. Bitch ass niggas. It's cool though. I got four torque, nigga. Four torque, you know what I'm saying? Four torquey. Well, you know what I mean? They fix my shit. We back on the road. If they don't, that shit gotta go. But yeah, we the fuck out, you know what I mean? Got my shit fresh and dandy. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, that M3Z. Dial, dial. And three was nice. 
slide. Oh, what y'all think, yo? Comment down below. So I was thinking this shit, right? And the light bulb pop up, you know, in your brain and shit. You just start, you know, contemplating shit. You know, just putting shit together. You know what I mean? I'm like a quarterback in this field. You know what I mean? I'm trying to put the plays together for my mans and them to, you know, for they to run that shit through. So thinking I should rotary swap the Mazda rear wheel drive or KE24 swap it. You know what I mean? Honda swap it. One of those two, bro. Out of them two, bro, that should be fire, bro. That should be hot. Like, I would love to do that. That's what I'm saying. I need my own shop, bro. Shop, bro. I'll be trying to put that shit to work and to use. But a rotary swap in this bitch would be crazy. That's going to do numbers. A rotary swap in the Mazda P5, bro. Come on now. That should have do numbers. That should have probably do everything. But, no, nah, that should have do everything. And make power. Stop playing. I'll get rid of this four-speed auto. Go crazy. I had to figure out what rear end I need to use because this is a uh, lateral arms and uh, the suspension arms and shit like that. It don't have no differential or nothing like that. So that's the only like problem. And then I had to figure out if I'm going to use the uh, exhaust tunnel to go through back with the drive shaft. But that, I mean, that's just in the, you know, thought of the mind that it'd be crazy. If not, I'll just, you know, keep it front wheel drive and just swap a different motor in it and, you know, do like, you know, the standalones and all that shit, the computer in. But we'll figure that out, bro. I just wanted to think and throw that out there to y'all, what y'all think about that. Rotary swap, 13B, or, you know, three rotor, whatever you want to do, four rotor. They got all it, but four rotors out of my price range, so I'd rather just do, like, you know, 13B or something, even though that shit is expensive, too, as well, but I just got to, you know, figure it out and find a cheap rotor, rotary engine, but I ain't nothing cheap in the Mazda form and that type of, you know, aspect of engine, or not, yeah, yeah aspect of engine, so I don't know. I was just thinking. But, uh, yeah, I'll get back to y'all in a little bit, man. I'm going to help my cousin and shit with the bumper. Yes, kid! So I let my cousin know I'm here. They know ain't nobody in the family got a Mazda that sound like that. You know what I'm saying? With 180K on that bitch. Is she coming to the door? That means she know my car. Yeah, hold up. She in a whip? No, but let's see what she, I mean, she got the Jeep right here. She got the Cherokee. So yeah, let's go see what she talking about. Fixed it, boy. I fixed it for my cousin. That shit was popped out. She hit a tire. Put that OEM shit and little bolt in there. Put the clips back in. I know the vibes. I know the vibes. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with your boy. Now I'm out of hit this bitch. I'm out. I'm about to go drop these keys off. I'm gonna see y'all in a bit. All right, y'all, I just got to the collision caliber. So I'm gonna go drop this keys off for the scat. It's on the other side. Look, they got an S95 right here too. I wish I could check that joint out. I'm gonna probably think about to take my camera over there. And they got a little, uh, I think, STI over there too. All right, y'all, I dropped off some keys. I was talking to David, so pretty cool guy. He's picking up the Integra A-Spec. I think he said tomorrow, and that's pretty good. That's nice. I hear all my clunky, clunky suspension. Oh my goodness. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> like I'm talking to kids back there. <laughs> no, I wouldn't talk to my kids like that, but damn. Like, damn, Becky, you doing me out dirty right now, bro. <laughs> no, but I'm all the way to the crib, y'all. <laughs> She's still rolling and rolling and rolling. Uh, I, can't, I can't justify the, you know what I mean? Doing nothing bad on my way home i'm just gonna take it easy um yeah that badass mustang that was over there man i took a picture of that motherfucker pop it up on the screen for y'all that shit was nice five speed 5.0 man that shit was nice only thing downfall you know a lot of people don't like the soft tops but i mean i can go for it if i had you I mean if i had it i i i'd enjoy it but yeah that was nice he had the same shifter as me but it was a different one uh, scat right there or well, probably 5.7 but yeah we're gonna get on our way to the crib if i catch this scat in traffic i'm gonna get some videos if i don't that's me fault look it go the same mercury i got y'all 5.0 and everything with the v8 see i would do different i mean i would do a different lift kit like a different lift kit on it and make it look better you know what i mean i don't i would take that black thing off the front of the hood and you know stuff like that for this type of for this car you know what i mean for this suv i would do it to that one but and then make it with bigger buffier tires and different rims but he has uh 
the hitch and everything on there too and it's wired so that's what i'm gonna do but i'm gonna get like a under like a under tuck um hitch for the back i like his back window been broke or something though. but yeah see that's not like the goal but it's like you know the look that i'm gonna go for and i'm gonna throw up a picture up on the screen which one i'm gonna go for though to be honest So, uh, yeah, just wanted to show y'all that. I seen that John yesterday. It wasn't too bad. But I'm on my way to the crib. It's time to get ghosts on these niggas. Woo-hoo-hoo. Cut up. Cut up season, nigga. Dick kid. I thought this Mazda wasn't a scat and left that nigga. <laughs> Left that nigga back there, bruh. <laughs>